How's it going lads and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are doing something pretty different. We are looking at a brand new app. Champions manager Mobisaka reached out to me and asked me to make a video on their app reviewing it and essentially giving my my thoughts on it and giving what I think of it to you guys and giving you guys an opportunity to download it if you guys enjoy it. Uh, so here is a little pre-roll of Champions manager Mobisaka. Marcelo performing a lovely piece of skill, breaking past the defender, keeping on dribbling, looking dangerous too. Great pass with the outside of the foot. A fantastic goal! Now, without further ado, I'm going to put my iPhone headphones on and we are going to jump straight into some Champions Manager Mobisaka. Uh, we're going to press tap to start. Now, this is available on iOS and Android. So if you're on Android, you can play on Android as well. Now, this is my team. This is this is the first thing you see is your team. As you see, we've got Glenn Johnson. We've got Renocchi. I've got a few names I recognize. We've got Luis Gustavo, Darren Fletcher. What a legend. Uh, Fernando Lorente, Andre Silva there as well, Jordan Amavi. Um, so there's a few things you can do. First of all, you can open st stuff like, for example, packs. Uh, on the reward section, you have uh, login rewards. So there we get 50 of the blue gems to claim for our daily login rewards. So we'll take that. Thank you very much. I'll take those 50 blue gems. That's what you used to open packs on this, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, and that is the rookie rewards. So uh, you, ca you can get a lot of different rookie rewards as you carry on leveling up, for example. I've got more than one 50 blue gems. I had two 50 blue gems. So we're on 300 blue gems now. Um, and there's a lot of different things you can claim. So uh, they will go and light up when you can actually claim all of these but there's daily ones, so there's daily objectives, basically. Uh, there's rookie challenges, and there's main objectives slash challenges that give you, obviously, bigger rewards, like 100 blue gems. So over on the right, you can also check out your uh, your individual players. Um, these are all my players, as you guys can see. Uh, you can sort them by rating or quality or name. You know, I'm going to sort them by rating. So we've only got 60 raids right now. 60 raids and 50 raids. So these are essentially bronzes in FIFA. We need some better players, to be honest. Uh, but there is a transfer market, so you can obviously sell some of your players if you want to. Um, you can lock players in, which keeps your players. You can get pieces. Uh, I'm still new to this game, so I don't 100% know all of this stuff. Uh, but we'll click on the blue gems, and, uh, and as you can see, you can actually buy the blue gems to get yourself packs. It's a lot cheaper than FIFA, let me tell you that. There's scouts on this as well. So, for example, uh, you need a scout. It costs 200 gems. So, it's scout X1, and you can get any of the plays on the screen. There's different styles of plays. I think it's like informs and special versions. That's probably the best way I would... Uh, I would describe it. So it costs 200 gems to get a scout. So we confirm and we get ourselves a silver Ashley Young item, which is not too bad, I think. I don't actually know. Can we get this one for cheaper? No, so it's 200 It's 200 gems to get those. So let's go back to our squad and have a look at Ashley Young. We need to go to our players real quick um, and see what rating that Ashley Young is. That's 70 rated. So it's we've got a better rated player there in Ashley Young. Um, and by equipping a jersey, you actually up his rating. So we've upped his rating by nine there, which is pretty cool. As you see, he's got decent dribbling. Uh, not the best of tackling or passing or finishing there. Um, so pretty much Ashley Young in real life, uh, there, as you see. Uh, but we want to go over to our squad and we want to actually uh, put Ashley Young in the squad. So Ashley Young's on the bench currently. Where should we put Ashley Young? We'll put Ashley Young in for Santon over there on the left wing there so we've got ashley young in there we want to save that there and we'll go into a game and actually play a game on this screen is pretty easy click on start and it's super easy to get into a game you can go into a top match a world tour career we're going to go into career and start our career so we've got a game over here we want to click on kickoff and uh, we'll go into a game now there is different factors in this game i should probably let you guys know about you can actually influence some certain decisions to actually for example score goals make passes etc you'll see as we go into it and i'll sort of talk you guys through it but there's some really cool things you can do so we want to skip this because i don't want to see any of this and it starts it's basically like football manager and it starts and plays for you until it's your uh input basically so this is a heroic moment you can actually uh make the pass or or, or decide what he does so basically he dribbles past um, you can make the pass uh, here again. Kabai is going to make more of a dribble. And then we're going to move Lorente into the position to actually pass it to Lorente to move forward, basically. Um, and as you see here, we actually have a shot. We're going to try and shoot. Uh, and hopefully we can score it. And we do. We score it. There we go. We've got a goal. So it's pretty cool. You get influence into it. Decide what you want to do. So your build-up play actually matters in this game, which I think is really, really cool. You can also skip all the normal play and just skip to your heroic moments, which is also a really cool feature. So you can literally skip through this. Uh, you can sim through the entire game. And we won. 
So as you see, we won. We, we had a heroic moment. We won 7-0. We'll take that. Not too shabby. Uh, a nice 7-0 victory there. And uh, we've cleared a stage. So we'll take that. We'll go ahead and confirm. And we've got another uh we've got another game here to play so we can go into a game there's a 1-2 a 1-1 one, 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 um and there's a bunch of other games we can go into so we'll go ahead uh go into 1-2 we'll go ahead and go and kick off and we'll play yet another game and i'll play a couple more heroic moments for you guys for this one so you can make you can make the speed faster um so literally the, the speed is just a lot faster goes through the games real quick um so here we go a heroic moment here i want to dribble past sanya here bakary sanya is gonna get dribbled past we're gonna Pass it to Luis Gustavo, who's going to get into the area there. I see that. I see that. And we have a header. I'm going to try and head it to the back post. Let's see. We've got a 98% chance of it going in, and it goes in. So we'll take that. 1-0. Not too shabby at all. Nice little 1-0 there. Um, we'll go forward with that. Obviously, a little bit of a cheesy chip cross into the box. Where have we ever seen that before? I wonder why I chose that. And then I see I see that run from Lorente. That's a beautiful run. Play that inwards. Lorente gets the ball, and I'm actually going to go for a near post shot here to go for the near poster a lot of people go far post but we went near post and unfortunately the keeper saved it so yeah that's unfortunate however we do have from the corner another shot can this go in excuse me the hiccups and it does go in there we go we've scored so uh it sees that the opponent is not a big deal we'll win easy go back and prepare for the next game so that is advised news to go and skip sim the rest of the match easy win easy life not too bad eight nil victory we are flying through now one thing that just happened is your players run out of juice they run out of stamina um so we could actually when we want to get to full recovery in an hour and 27 minutes so you don't have to spend anything or you can spend 50 gems to get to full recovery straight away we're not going to spend the gems we're actually going to go over to the store and see what we have so we have scouts available uh unfortunately we need 100 more gems but uh there's rookie scouts that unfortunately are 100 gems is there anything we can buy here i would like to buy something uh 200 gems no please plus you can buy individual scouts though like you can buy certain ones we need more gems though game we need more gems now if you actually input this code you can actually get yourself some what they call gifts so we have to check our email now to get our gifts uh let's go ahead to our email we get a reward we check the reward we claim it we get 200 free blue gems which is actually very nice so we do in fact get ourselves essentially one free pack or one free scout so we'll go over to the store i want to get a real madrid scout because i think we could get either like a varan which would be fantastic a danny carvajal a bale so let's go ahead and get a scout please give me like a bale or something insufficient gems excuse me what do you mean brother oh maybe it was 200 gems there we go we got ourselves stecklenburg great brilliant just what we wanted <laughs> I mean, it's better than what we have already. So we'll go ahead and add Stecklenburg into the squad. Um, and we're starting to build up a little bit. We're starting to build up. Uh, Ezra, you can come out. Stecklenburg, you're in. We'll save that. You can actually change a lot of things in the squad. But it's just a cool little game you can play on your phone. I think this will be something I play a little bit more when I'm traveling, for example. As, like I said, you can play it on your phone. Or like I have a, ta I have a tablet. It's kind of off screen. But I have a tablet that I would be playing it on as well uh, more than my phone. And uh, it's just a fun game. It's like it's essentially like a career mode sort of game. Um where you could actually you can get packs and stuff like that and i just think it's quite fun so i thought i'd bring this video to you guys because i actually do like the app i like it i've been playing it a little bit on a different account uh because they wanted uh, they obviously wanted to give me some gifts and game and stuff like that so uh, i played on a different account um to try it out and i do think it's really fun so hopefully you guys do try it out because it's a lot of fun to play this game i think that the, the user input is a lot more fun than different games for example uh, allowing you to sort of take your own shots and stuff it's just a really cool concept really But that's it for this video. If you guys have enjoyed, leave a like down below. I want to thank you all massively. I am very grateful to all of you guys for allowing me to be in a position like this, to be able to take sponsored deals like this and uh, and support myself financially. I'm very grateful. I want to thank you all for that. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you all just for being legends. I appreciate you all very much. So thank you for watching. I'll see you later.